Hello everyone and welcome back. If you're interested in what great deals are available for Inside Track Club members during the month of June, then you're in luck. In this video, I'm going to be covering the Inside Track Club deals that are available at Harbor Freight during the month of June 2023. So stick around and let's get into it. All right, everyone, welcome back. Let's get started with the coupons that are available for Inside Track or ITC members at Harbor Freight. These are the coupons or deals that are available right now for Inside Track Club members during the month of June 2023. And if you want to see all these deals, they are available at my website. There is my website domain right there. Just type that into your browser. And at my website under the Extras tab, just look for the Inside Track Club deals for June 2023 and you'll be able to see every single one of these deals or coupons however you want to call them and that way you can get your list in order figure out exactly what you want to buy during the month of June so let's go through there's over 200 different coupons that I have available for you guys I'm probably not going to talk about every single item in this flyer but I will cover some of them that may look interesting or maybe really good or really bad deals. So let's get started. And we start off looking right here at the Predator 6500 watt gas powered portable generator with CO Secure technology for 600 bucks, 80 bucks off right now, 680 normally. Now 6500 watts is a pretty big generator and as you see right there it's pretty big and bulky with wheels and everything. If you don't want something that big, if you want something a little bit smaller, I just did a review of a much cheaper and smaller generator with 4400 watts of power and you can check that out. I'll put a link up in the corner, you can go check out that video if you're interested in the generator but you don't need something as big or as expensive as this one. The other one is almost half price compared to this one so you can go check that out. And right here, if you're looking for a 34 inch full bank service cart available in eight different colors, you can get this guy right now for 500 bucks. It's 100 bucks off, 600 bucks normally. So that's a good savings right there for ITC members. And let's see, let's look at some jacks. If you're looking for some Daytona jacks, you have a couple to choose from right there. The low profile one for 240 bucks right now in three different colors. Or you can get the regular Daytona Jack for 135 bucks right now, say 35 bucks on this guy. On the low profile, you get a bigger savings, 50 bucks off right now. And if you're looking for an inexpensive service cart, this is not a bad deal right here. The 30 inch service cart with a drawer. It looks like two, but it's only one drawer. It just has two handles on it, but it's one big drawer. So if you're looking for a service card to carry your tools around and stuff like that for a hundred bucks even, that's not bad right there, 40 bucks off. And it comes in seven different colors, so it can match all your other stuff in your shop. And if you're looking for a Pittsburgh Jack, there you go right there for 180 bucks, the 2.5 ton aluminum racing Jack, 40 bucks off on this guy. If you want a different service cart, I know a lot of people like these polypropylene carts right here. 36 by 24 inch, 120 bucks for this guy right now. Only 20 bucks off, not a major savings. You can get them cheaper some other time. So if you don't want to run out and get it right now, you can wait and see what else shows up. Maybe next month or in a few weeks. You never know what extra deals Harbor Freight is going to put out. And one that is a good deal is this guy right here. The Yukon 46 inch mobile workbench with solid hardwood top available in three different colors. And this guy is the one with the doors on the front, not the drawers. So you have one big drawer up top and then some doors here that open up to expose some shelving on the inside. This guy is a really good deal for ITC members at only 300 bucks. And I know you say only 300 bucks it's not it's not inexpensive but when you looked at it, it was 380 before 80 bucks off that is a good deal that is the cheapest it's been in quite a long time so that's not too bad right there or the titanium unlimited 200 professional multi-process welder 750 bucks right now this guy is also a hundred bucks off 850 normally so itc members can save some good money on this guy right now save yourself a hundred bucks and if you're looking for a service card 89.99 for this guy 90 bucks only 10 bucks off not that great a deal a lot of times they'll drop this even lower so i wouldn't even bother with that one and if you're looking for a 20 ton hydraulic bottle jack 40 bucks for this guy 33 percent off Motorcycle ATV lift right there, 1,500 pound capacity from Pittsburgh, 190 bucks right there. 
Let's see, if you're looking for a smaller jack from Daytona, you can save yourself a couple of bucks right there. The one and a half ton professional racing series aluminum floor jack for 110 bucks right there, 25 bucks off of that guy. And if you're looking for a four in one convertible hand truck, 500, 800, and 1,000 pound capacity, 175 bucks for this guy, 25 bucks off. Again, not a major savings, but if you need it, you can save some money right there. And if you're looking for a different welder right there from Vulcan, this is an expensive guy. The Protec 205 industrial welder with 120 and 240 input, 1049, 1050 bucks right there. But if you need it and it works for you, there you go. You can get 150 bucks savings on this guy right now. And let's see what else we have. We have the Cover Pro 10x10 10 10 portable shed for 170 bucks right there, 30 bucks off of that guy. And these service carts, this one's not too bad. The Pittsburgh 500 pound capacity hydraulic table cart right there. These come in really handy. I have one and I've used it quite a bit for a lot of different projects. 200 bucks right now, 50 bucks off. There's some decent savings. And right here, the Bauer Modular Rolling Toolbox, 60 bucks for this guy, 14% off. 60 bucks is really not too bad considering that is a pretty big and sturdy toolbox right there. That'll last you a long time being a hard plastic box. And moving right along, these guys right here are always a good deal. From Stick Tech, the 60 foot by 3 quarter inch industrial grade electrical tape 10 pack, 549, save yourself 21%, normally 699. 55 cents per roll. That's very inexpensive right there. That's not too bad. You go to Home Depot, you try to buy some of these, it's going to be a lot more than that. And if you're looking for a welding helmet, here you go. The titanium 9.3 square inch auto darkening welding helmet for 80 bucks. 30 bucks off on that guy. If you need a welding helmet, save some money right now. And if you're looking at a battery for your Atlas equipment, there you go right there. The 80 volt 4 amp or 40 volt 8 amp extreme performance lithium ion battery. 200 bucks right now. 50 bucks off. That's why I always tell you guys, when you look at things that you're going to buy at Harbor Freight, when it says tool only, think about it carefully because look at how expensive the batteries can be. They make it look really cheap because if you get an Atlas product without the battery, it looks really cheap. But think about it. You got to add another 200 bucks on top of that. So always bear that in mind so you don't get fooled into buying something that you didn't really expect how much the price was going to be. And if you're looking for a Bauer 9-gallon wet-dry shop vac right there, 69 bucks, 13% off. And if you need some front-wheel drive axle lock nut set right there, seven pieces from Pittsburgh half-inch drive, 45 bucks for this guy. And if you're looking for an inexpensive 7.5 amp, one half inch variable speed hammer drill driver, 30 bucks for this guy, normally 40, 25% off. That's not too bad. It's a corded drill. That'll last you a long time. Plugs into the wall, no batteries, and nothing to worry about in that respect. 30 bucks, that's fairly inexpensive compared to other brands. And if you're looking for an inexpensive welder, here you go from Chicago Electric Welding, the 80 amp inverter arc welder, 140 bucks right now, normally 170, save yourself 30 bucks. You know, I've never been into welding and metalworking and stuff like that. I've generally concentrated on being good at getting things done with wood, whether it's building things, furniture, cabinets, whatever the heck it is. But as I get into my older age, I decided I may try to do some work with some welding and stuff like that. If you guys have any suggestions as to what's a good product to get, I'm thinking of getting something along the lines of a MIG welder. Maybe even plasma cutter, stuff like that. Just start doing more work with metal. Any suggestions you guys have, I'd love to hear comments down below as to where to start off, what products to get, what to look at, that kind of good stuff. And I don't know, I'll give it a shot. Maybe I'll do some welding or plasma cutting videos in the future. I mean, what could go wrong, right? Either I'll make a great video or it'll be a big old poo-poo. You guys will get some good chuckles out of that. So who knows? We'll see what comes up in the future. Yeah, let's move right along. Here we go with a Merlin color-coded coupler and plug set. 14 pieces right there for 14 bucks. That's not too bad. 15 bucks technically, 25% off. Not too bad. Normally 20 bucks. Save yourself some money. And if you're looking for an inexpensive jack, there you go from Pittsburgh. The four-ton hydraulic bottle jack for under 20 bucks. Only 18 bucks right now. Normally 30 bucks. Save yourself 40%. That's pretty inexpensive for a little bottle jack. Four tons, that'll lift just about anything out there, unless you're getting into really heavy duty equipment and so forth, and you need something bigger. And if you want from Banks a 15 degree coil roofing nailer for only 100 bucks, save yourself 30 bucks, normally 130. 
And let's see, if you want yourself a 1,000 pound capacity solid deck hardwood dolly with carpeting, there you go. That way you can put stuff on top of it and not worry about getting the product damaged. 28 bucks right there, 15% off. 24 by 16, that'll handle quite a few things. And if you want a creeper for your shop, there you go from Icon. The 400 pound capacity 43 inch professional creeper. There you go for 100 bucks, 140 bucks normally. Save yourself 40 bucks. Now this is a nice, convenient, nicely padded creeper and so forth. Looks very nice for getting under a vehicle and all that. The one thing that catches my eye is that you don't have any tool tray. You don't have any place to put your tools. And that's one of the things most of the other creepers out there have is some kind of a tool tray. Because when you slide under a vehicle, you want to be able to have your tools nicely and easily accessible. So I don't know about this design. It looks nice and comfy and all, but where do you keep your tools? You have to drag them along with you. Then if you forgot something, you got to get out from under the car and go back again. I don't know about that. It seems a little bit uh, not good design. And here you go if you're looking for a inexpensive oscillating tool from Warrior. A two amp variable speed oscillating multi-tool for 15 bucks. Normally 25, save yourself 40% right there. Or if you're looking for a 15 amp 7 inch trigger grip angle grinder with a 180 degree rotating body. 65 bucks right now, normally 85, save yourself 23%. Let's see what else do we have. Well these magnets are not bad, 4 bucks right now. The 25 pound capacity magnetic hooks in 8 different colors from US General. 4 bucks, normally 7, save yourself 42%, not too bad. And here you go with the ammo boxes. I know a lot of people like these for 8 bucks right now, normally 10 bucks, 20% off. And you know what, I'll point out, in case you're not aware, you can get these also for about the same price at Walmart. The only difference is, here at Harbor Freight, they only have them in one color, gray. You can have any color you want as long as it's gray. That's the way it is. The old Ford model right there. But if you go to Walmart, they have like five or six different colors to choose from, including clear. So you can see through it and that way you know what's inside. So check it out at Walmart if you want a different kind of color with it. And let's see what else do we have. You know, this little light right here, the Braun, the 1250 lumens LED rechargeable battery bank and work light for 20 bucks. 28% off, normally 28 bucks. You know, it's not a bad little light, but I will warn you, if you haven't seen this light and you're thinking about getting it, let me tell you, I did a review on this light when it first came out a couple of years ago, and it's an okay light, but there's a lot better lights on the market for about the same price. Because this light has a few little defects to it. First of all, right here in the middle, it is hollow. The handle is solid at the two corners, but where this little screw and this screw stops, it is hollow. I could literally bend it in half right there in the middle. So I see that as a breaking point at some point if you hang on to it long enough. Second of all, like I mentioned before, a lot of times, Harbor Freight and their specs are a little bit loosey-goosey. Don't trust everything they say. This light says 1250 lumens. You know what, I did a review of this light and in that video I did a comparison between this light and a light from Walmart that was only 1000 lumens and guess what? The 1000 lumens was brighter than this one. So I really don't trust the numbers when Harbor Freight puts them out. They're not 100% accurate. Why would a smaller light with less lumens be more powerful than this one? And it's in my video, it's proof positive right there. You can go look at it if you like, and that'll tell you everything you need to know about this light. So I just want you guys to be informed if you do decide to get this light. And let's see, what else do we have? Right here, if you're looking for an inexpensive drill from Warrior, 4.5 amp, one half inch single speed hammer drill. It's not too bad, only one speed. That could be a little inconvenient. I would always go towards a variable speed drill because you don't want to go from zero to 100% in one shot. But if you're looking for an inexpensive drill for doing stuff around the house, 18 bucks right there. And if you're looking for some magnetic parts holder, the Pittsburgh 4 inch magnetic part holder, $1.30 right there, 56% off, normally 3 bucks. And if you're looking for a drill light -like combo kit right there, another inexpensive combo, 12 volt cordless, 3 8 inch drill driver and flashlight, that's not too bad, for 20 bucks. You get the drill driver, the flashlight, batteries, chargers, everything. 20% off right now, under 20 bucks, you really can't go wrong with this one. This is one of those cases that I say it's good for doing stuff around the house. Buy it, use it, abuse it. When it goes bad, you toss it out, move on to the next one. For 20 bucks, you really can't go wrong. 
And here we go, looking at these tools right here from Atlas, exactly what I was referring to earlier. Here you go with the Atlas blower, 80 volt brushless cordless, 150 mile per hour blower, tool only. So $65 for this guy right now, 13% off. But look at it this way, 65 bucks plus 200. So literally this tool will cost you 265 bucks. You saw the battery we looked at before, it was $200 for an 80 volt battery. So literally this blower will cost you 265 bucks plus tax. So bear that in mind. This guy right here as well, the Atlas 80 volt brushless cordless 16 inch string trimmer tool only 70 bucks. 70 plus 200, 270 bucks is what this string trimmer will cost you if you don't have any Atlas batteries. And that's not even mentioning the charger. The charger is going to be another 30 bucks on top of that. So you're looking at almost $300 for this string trimmer or over $300 for this blower when you put in together the tool, the battery, and the charger. That's rather expensive. You can get tools that are comparable for a lot less money. So don't be fooled by their gimmick of the tool only making it look much, much cheaper because in the long run, it really is not. And here you go. If you're looking for an all-purpose tarp right there, 8x10 for 20 bucks, very inexpensive. And this guy right here, I will also give you another warning. The Chicago Electric Welding 100 watt soldering gun kit for 24 bucks, 20% off, normally 30 bucks. Don't buy this gun. I have this gun. I bought it like three, four years ago. I did a review on it and I was very happy with it. It seemed like a very nice tool. But six months later, it doesn't want to work anymore. So at first, it seems like a really good product. But if you hang on to it for a little while, it just stops working. I haven't taken it apart to figure out what the deal is with it, but it'll just hum and hum and hum, but it won't get hot. I can touch the tip with my fingers and not feel anything except just a little bit of warm temperature. That's all. It doesn't even get hot enough to melt the solder. So I definitely do not recommend this. I put a note on that video indicating that I do not recommend it any longer. Now this guy over here, I do recommend. I bought this guy again like four or five years ago and I've caught and relocated a whole bunch of critters out of my yard. For 25 bucks, it is a steal. When you compare it to like Home Depot, they have something similar for 50 bucks. So it's a good little buy right there. 32 by 15 by 10 medium animal trap. It's a good deal. This one I can definitely recommend. And let's see, here we go with different things to look at. Uh, what do we have right here? The Warrior three quarter inch carbon steel hole saw kit, 18 pieces for 10 bucks. Not a bad deal. I've done a lot of reviews recently putting in door locks and stuff like that where these hole saws come in really, really handy. If you want to have a whole kit like that with a lot of pieces for all sorts of different size holes you got to cut for 10 bucks, you really can't go wrong. 33% off right there. And here you go with the Bauer 20 volt cordless string trimmer tool only. I didn't highlight this one here, but tool only 40 bucks. Keep in mind, if you're not in the Bauer family, you still have to get the battery and charger. They're cheaper for Bauer compared to Atlas, but you're still looking at another 50, 60, 80 bucks more on top of this if you don't have any other Bauer tool. So bear that in mind. And here's one thing that I thought was really cool right here. The Central Machinery 7x10 inch precision bench top mini lathe for 730 bucks. I wonder, have any of you guys tried this? I thought this was so cool. Instead of having a really big gigantic lathe, might be cool having a little tiny lathe like that. I may look around, 50 bucks off of this guy right now. I don't know if I want to spend 730 bucks on this one, but I may look around and I may find something cheaper on Amazon or something else. Don't be surprised if at some point I do a video on a mini lathe because I'm finding it to be very intriguing and I'm really interested in getting something like that. So you might see one coming up real soon. And let's see, here we go. A drop cloth, six by nine canvas drop cloth for seven bucks, 30% off right there. Or if you want to rock and roll in your little rolling work seat right there in tool tray from One Stop Garden, 70 bucks right there. Stick a V8 and a turbo on this thing. You can rock and roll down the street all you like. There you go. And here you go. If you're looking for a cement mixer, the one and a quarter cubic foot cement mixer from Central Machinery, 180 bucks right there. 20 bucks off, normally 200 bucks. Not a bad price comparing it to Home Depot and stuff like that. Their cement mixers are closer to 300 bucks. So under 200 bucks, that is a good price for that guy right there. And if you're looking for some black oxide step drill bit set right there, two pieces for 23 bucks, normally 28, 17% off, not too bad. 
Or if you're looking for a 24 compartment large storage container for four bucks, keep all your little bits and bobs organized in nice little different compartments and so forth. So there you go, get that and keep things organized for yourself. And talking about welding, there you go with some welding blankets, four by six fiberglass welding blanket for 20 bucks. That's not too bad. Normally 23 bucks, 13% off. And there you go with a nice toolbox right there, 19 inch toolbox with top tray for 10 bucks from Voyager, 23% off. Now this guy is another one that I will definitely stay to stay away from. The toolbox set four pieces, 28 bucks. Don't throw your money away, folks. These boxes, I had them, and I eventually threw every single one of them away because they are so fragile. They're so they, they really use a cheap plastic on this. Really, that's the only way I can put it. A really cheap, crappy plastic. You drop it, it breaks. You put tools in it too hard, it breaks. You look at it funny, it breaks. It is really that bad. Every single one of these, eventually, over time, I broke them, I cracked them, they, I just had to throw them away. They're really that bad. So money down the drain, do not buy this even for five bucks. Don't get it, waste the money. And yeah, let's see, what else do we have? Here you go, if you're looking for a 30 inch, three in one shear press break and slip roll, 550 bucks, 80 bucks off. Save yourself some money on that guy. Or a turbo nozzle pressure washer, turbo nozzle for 28 bucks. You know, most pressure washers come with these, so don't buy one thinking that your kit may not have it. Check that first before you get it. And this little light right here, the 180 lumens rotating magnetic LED work light for four bucks, not worth the money, folks. I've seen this at the store. I don't think it's 180 lumens. To me, it seems like 80 lumens. It is very, very weak. And for four bucks, there are better lights out there. I would definitely not recommend that one. Uh, let's see, what other good stuff do they have? Well, here you go with the Hallmaster Mini Elastric Stretchy Cords, 20 pieces for six bucks. That's not too bad. 14% off, which is only a buck off, but it's not too bad for six bucks. 20 pieces, you get quite a bit in there. And here you go with the Bauer Heavy Duty Job Site Backpack for 60 bucks, 20% off, not too bad. And these little bar counter swivel stool with flame design for 32 bucks. If you haven't seen this at the store, I suggest you look at it first. Don't get it online until you look at it. I've seen this at the store. It's a nice looking stool, very nice design, but the cheap plastic that they put on it, I am really concerned that after you sit in it for just a couple of weeks, it's gonna start cracking and breaking. So look at it first, get your own personal opinion on it, but I don't think it's a very high quality. And let's see, what else do we have here? Here you go with an electric string trimmer from Bauer. 5.5 amp, 15 inch, this is electric, so the price you see is the price you pay, 40 bucks right there. You do have to have a cord dangling around, but you don't have any price increases on that guy. And let's see, what else do we have here? Oh, this light right here, this is one that also wanted to point out. 56 lumens emergency triangle LED work light for 249, 250. 399 normally, 37% off. You know, this is a good light with good potential, but unfortunately they cheaped out. Let me tell you a couple things. First of all, I like this. I have like three of these. They're really nice little light. Works really well in a pinch if you break down somewhere because it is a white light, it is a blinking red light, and it is a blinking white light. So you could use it to illuminate whatever problem you have, and you can use it as a red triangle to let people know that you're in trouble if you're broken down on the side of the road. The only problem is that they used a really cheap plastic on it, and it gets all sweaty and sticky over time. At first, when you get it in the store, it seems perfectly fine. But I've had some of these that I've had for several years. And the other day, I went to grab one, and it was all sticky and gooey. And the only thing I can suggest, if you like it and you want to get it, is clean it off really, really good with solvent. And then, I don't know, put like a clear coat on it to make sure that it seals it up and it doesn't get all gummy and gooey and stuff like that. That's what I had to do with mine. Put a clear coat on it, that way it'll stop the degradation of that plastic. Again, good product, but Harbor Freight cheaped out on it. Cheap plastic gets gooey. You know how nasty that can be if you've come across that before. Not a good thing. And let's see right here. You want some tape measures? There you go from Bauer, 25 foot one inch. Slide lock tape measure, five bucks right there for a 25 footer. And they have a lot more thing, a lot more tape measures further down. Here you go, Icon Professional Universal Joint Socket Adapter 3 piece for 30 bucks. Wow, 40 bucks normally, 25% off. You know, you can get the Pittsburgh one for about five bucks. <laughs> so it's up to you if you want to toss out 30 bucks or get the Pittsburgh for one third the price. So there you go. Here's another one, eight bucks, 
for a 30 footer so they got a lot of bauer tape measures on sale for you guys right now and here you go from bauer a compressor they finally have compressors from bauer the 1.6 gallon 135 psi 20 volt brushless cordless air compressor tool only for 150 bucks right now 10 bucks off so keep in mind you got to have the battery and charger but if you want a cordless compressor you got one right there and here you go with the ultra grip flexible parts tray right there for 10 bucks from us general 33 percent off so there's a bunch of stuff that you can save money here and get some good deal but some stuff not so much if you want a smaller tape measure right there 16 footer for six bucks right there or from bauer another one the hedge trimmer tool only 45 bucks if you're not in the bauer family you're going to have to spend more money keep that in mind so here we go all right guys here we are at the end of the video that's all the coupons available right now for june 2023 for the itc members hope you enjoyed the video hit that thumbs up button hit that subscribe button and i'll see you guys on the next one bye bye for now